Hello, ladies and gentlemen, let's get the show on the road. So here we are with episode four of Let's Play Star Wars The Old Republic by BioWare. So we were just going to... Know. I believe that's the one. Really? All right. Hey, you! Careful, Tino. Come on, I'm actually for some action. You there? Are you the big shot they're all talking about? The one who's been personally summoned by Darth Barriss himself? Watch this. Bike your own good curb your curiosity. Please pardon my over-eager friend. It's just that we've heard so much about you. And we want to get in good with you. Tino, what my blunt partner here means is that if you need anything or anyone, say, dealt with, we'd like you to consider us. She's talking about Vemrin. We'll kill him for you. <laughs> Sorry. I should have had Tino muzzled. <laughs> so, what do you say? We know Vemrin tried to have you killed. Would you like him eliminated? <laughs> I'm preserving the pleasure for myself. Far be it for us to rob you of such an experience, but consider this. There are rules. Acolytes are not to openly kill one another. Everyone knows of your rivalry. If you kill him, the Lords will presume your guilt. But if Vemrin croaks while you get an alibi, people might be suspicious, but they won't be able to pin it on you. See? Ha! <laughs> Not consider me nodding. No, this isn't how I handle it. Are you okay? Huh? <laughs> no, I'm not interested. Sorry. Let us prove ourselves to you. Spar with us, then decide if we have the skills to benefit you in this endeavor. <laughs> you should be warned. I will not hold back. There will be injuries. Well, that's the chance we're willing to take. Come on, boys. <laughs> Time to show our stuff. I'm just excited to kick some ass. Okay, here we go. So... took all four of us apart. This changes everything. From what I hear, Vemrin's every bit your physical equal. If we can't even hold up sparring against you, we'll never be able to kill him. You got it all wrong. Vemrin is just a lot of big talk and reputation. Really? You mean he gets by on the illusion of strength? What does this mean, Fine? <laughs> it means Vemrin is a dead man. And we're going to have the most potent of allies. Oh, but... No! I want to kill him myself! I don't know what just happened. Most of you will not return from this endeavor. If you die, you will be forgotten. If you give up, you will be killed. No, out of my sight. I've got a bad feeling about this. You should. This is the end of the line for you, Clemrel. Just make sure you stay out of my way. Look here, Vemrin. I see the upstart, but no sign of Douglas. Clemrel, Vemrin, you have been dismissed. Yes, <laughs> Master. I underestimated you by sending Douglas. It will not happen again. Are you having trouble with Acolyte Vemrin, supplicant? He's playing with fire. If he insists on getting in my face like that, he's going to have trouble with me. He has been hardened into a lethal machine. Venron has paid his dues. He's fought a deck stacked against him to get here. You, on the other hand. Let me get a closer look at you. Yes, as I suspected. Overseer Tremel has done you and this academy a great disservice. What? Your war blade came early. Prisoners flown in for your convenience. Even a beast here on Korriban <laughs> instead of off-world in the wild. The pacing of the trials is deliberate. Only full immersion over time produces results. Your mind is soft. Have your fun now. I'm gonna do that one. 
Undisciplined. I'll remember that, and someday you'll regret those words. <laughs> I wouldn't regret destroying you where you stand. The first month of trials should be dedicated to philosophy, conceptual Are these tactics, nipples? understanding of the Sith Code. Recite the Sith Code for me, Acolyte, and explain its meaning in battle, war, and politics. Watch this, watch this, watch this. The only code I need to know is kill or be killed. Oh. Your ability is undeniable, but your readiness and your understanding of the Sith way is woefully lacking. I am your master now. Tremel was becoming lax before you ever arrived. His unwillingness to adapt to the evolving Sith paradigm has become a liability. These are the actions of a traitor. Traitors are executed. I grant you immunity from punishment. Kill Tremel and bring back his hand as proof. I don't get this. These are the actions of a traitor. Traitors are executed. I grant you immunity, punish, kill, travel, and get uh, bring back his hand as proof. My dream has come true. If I have to. So how do if I have to? I become light. My dream has come true. Of course. <laughs> what the frick? So, of course, would mean yes for sure. If I have to, would mean, oh, uh, okay. My dream has come true. I'm hoping that means kick this guy's ass. It would be my extreme pleasure. Or not. No, leave. I'm sure Trevor That right there, children. ladies and gentlemen, was Don't a forced return. decision no matter what. Yeah. Fat piece of shit. I could have taken you off. Oh, man. I'm actually a little disappointed there, ladies and gentlemen. I was forced to. Let's just say I'm a rape victim. Okay, so. Oh god, I hate all these missions. I have L, I guess. A new master. Okay. Here we go. So, where are we going today? Oh, here he is. So what do you guys think? Tell me what you thought about that. Do you think I really should have been able to choose? Because I felt like I needed to be able to choose. I felt like I got raped there. Maybe, just maybe, I can still choose? I didn't expect to see you again so soon. Has Barris sent you back to me? Oh, what? I'm here to kill you. Then I have been outplayed. Paris has the authority, but I did not think he would do something this overt. <laughs> Either I die, or he forces me to kill you, and to destroy my own plan. A master stroke. Very well, you have your orders, Acolyte. Know that it gives me no pleasure to kill you. <laughs> what? Oh, there's a... Hold on. It doesn't have to come to this, Tremel. Do not hedge, Mal. This is the way of the Sith. I'll try to make your end quick and painless. It's the least I can do. I, I meant, like, I didn't want to kill you. Great, what an asshole. I was getting to like him, too. Now I have to kill him? He's a level 7 elite. How am I supposed to... No heals of any kind. Clearly need to come back. <laughs> uh. I'd rather just do this one here. <sighs> so, ladies and gentlemen, I got my butt handed to me by a coward. You know what we're doing? We're gonna buy that weapon. It's a little expensive, but we need to kick his ass, don't we? Especially now I've been embarrassed. So where was that weapon vendor? Was he... Oh, 
he or she was over here. Looks like a she. Hello. Hi. This game is like full of customization, yet we all Your look the same. Always good here. Oh man, that's a little cheaper than I thought. <laughs> I meant like, I was hoping a better. Yeah, it's better anyways. Come again. No, I meant like I was hoping for like a better weapon, like a kick-ass weapon. Um, ooh, look at this one. Didn't even notice those nice new pants. So let's try the medium armor. Apparently, if you go tank or whatever, I've got the best you can go and the best prices. Okay, so can I just sell right click? Okay, so heavy armor. Apparently, you can't even wear heavy armor till you're level ten. Go figure. Wait, I don't even have a wristband. Uh, okay. Looking to upgrade your arsenal? So we can consider upgrading. Wait, do Good I even hunting. have a belt? Oh no, I don't. That's a nice addition. Oh, bracer. What level are these? Five? And what? Okay. Oh, these are some of these are level seven. So this belt is level five. Oh, okay, belt bracer. Good hunting. Thank you, sir. No. Oh no, never mind. That's the stat changes. I hate the stat crap. Why can't you do it properly? I've got the best hardware and the best prices. <laughs> Sounds so Good long, hunting. Anyways. There we go. Oh, cool. I have like a, a set here. So what do you guys think? You think I'm good enough to kick his ass now? Let's hope so. Because he handed it to me, bro. He handed it to me. So let's get my buff on this time, which I actually forgot this buff. So... Um, I wonder if I need a trainer or not. Is there a trainer out there? I don't think so, but... Let's see, uh, trainer. Yeah, well, let's give it a shot without a trainer, and if I get my ass handed to me, then we know we should have gone to the trainer just in case if there's a new skill or not. But I mean, I think I'm gonna do a lot more damage now, so I think I shouldn't have too many problems, but hey, what do I know? Hey, at least you guys can see there was actually some challenge there. That was actually a bit impressive. I mean, usually games have zero challenge in any way possible. Oh, crap. I went to the wrong place, didn't I? Failure. Failure. It's too bad we have to defeat the guy. And then I tried to be nice. Instead, it's like, hey, you know, I feel like an idiot. Because when I try to talk it out kind of thing, like it doesn't have to be this way, I thought, hey, maybe him and me can come up with a cunning way to, uh, you know, go behind their back and kick ass. But instead, I was defeated again with my own words saying, hey, bitch, you know, open my ass up and uh, I'll take it from you. Huh, look at the Godcraft instance. This is like Godcraft. Like, that's like a worthy screenshot right there. So, uh... Yeah, sorry that you must die again. Holy crap. I should have bought heals. I would have. I think I may actually be fine, maybe, but, uh. Buy heals next time. What was that? Wait, he's not even... From what I've seen, I better heal up before I talk to you. Watch his health actually heal up himself. Yeah, silly me, I should have bought just one heal, that would have helped a lot. No? I'm amazed. I knew you were strong in the force, but not like this. You're more than ready to challenge Vemrin. Barris won't be able to deny that now. He'll have the satisfaction of my death. But I die knowing my success. 
Go ahead. <laughs> End this. I just need your hand. <laughs> You're getting ahead of yourself. I only need your hand. What? Wait. I think I understand. Alice <laughs> demands my hand. Proof of my death. I don't want your pity, acolyte. Okay, then die. Fine. Have it your way. <laughs> death it is. Farewell. I like her acolyte. face, how she opened her mouth. Death it is. The purity of the Sith lies with you. I had purity till you shoved the lightsaber up my dick. Or, hey, vagina. I forgot I'm playing a female here. But you never know. Maybe this is a he she. I'm playing a he she. So. Just killed my so called master who's never. <laughs> what the? Oh, what is this? I feel like this is a setup. Come here, child. Do you intend to explore the academy? To oh, never mind. I don't want to talk to you right now, bitch. She's an elite. Level 10 elite. Still find that sad. Now I wonder if elites are gonna be somewhat that easy in this game. I mean, if you tweaked out and you know really work hard, modify your items and etc. I wonder if an even level or even one or two level higher elite can be defeated by a player. Because I mean that'd be pretty badass. You know, a difficult mob that you may die easily. Under, you strong, know. But you could be wow. stronger. Uh, retaliates against the target for a hunter and weaponry no longer be used after successfully. Oh, huh, cool down six seconds. Huh, maybe right here. Put that over there. Maybe that over here. Crap, I gotta start, uh... Oh, why do you do that, Bioware? I'm opposite way. I want, like, my ones down here and, uh, oh, whatever. Why do you do that? See if this will work. Anyways, okay. What is this? Four screen blast the target with. Oh, that's kind of cool and w wimpy. I'd rather get like this one, this one, and I have enough money for it anyway. So whatever. Whatever. Show no mercy. Well, thank you, sir. I plan not. What? What? Okay. Now we're going to that guy. See here. Do 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 do. Entering Storia area. Storia area? Did I just say Storia area? Wow. What's this? The Acolyte returns, and with a bloodied weapon. I assume this means Tremel is no more. Give me his hand. Here, take this one ring as a memento. Remembering the past can strengthen resolve and embolden the spirit. <laughs> I am impressed you had the fortitude to destroy him. You know he thought of you as family. How did it feel to betray him? It was a day I will long remember. I savored it completely. <laughs> Good. Feast on that. Not every kill will be as meaningful. You have taken your first step to understanding the Sith Code. Peace is a lie. There is only passion. Through passion, we gain strength. Through strength, we gain power. Through power, we gain victory, and through victory, our chains are broken. The Force shall set us free. By embracing the code and destroying Tremel, what a spanker. you have freed yourself from his shackles and escaped his fate. Ah, <laughs> look at this. Different master, same fate. And now I'm bound by your shackles. 
you'll find they are a marked improvement with much greater potential range. Now, there are sacred ruins in the tomb of Tulak Horde. The ancient inscriptions that once adorned the walls of each ruin lie in pieces. You will venture through the entire tomb, search all of the ruins, and bring me a shard from each of these I think they should have done a better job with his helmet. This Just because, you like, since you're not that. looking at a face that moves, Vemran and my other kind of... Have already been sent. There are no rules regarding how they secure the shards, and they will stop at nothing. Fight your way through the tomb of Tulakord in the Valley of the Dark Lords and bring me the shards from each of the ruined shrines. <laughs> what the heck? Ooh, lots of EXP. Aw, just a bunch of credits. Give a gift to your companion to show your affection. I'm a little laughing at that, but okay. So, basically now we're back to just doing missions. And, uh, yeah. Mission, mission, mission. Yeah. Um, so, I probably will end this one soon. Because I don't want to bore you guys with... Uh, me just hunting around, but maybe that's something you guys want, and I can't really ask since I'm doing a lot of these recordings at once, so, even though, yeah, oh well, I guess we'll continue a bit here. So, the valley of the, okay, way down there. I was like, what did I just do? I wanted to, like, inspect them. Oh, there's a... So here's more interface. Inspect player, follow player, add friends list, report for spam, all that. Inspect player. Here we go. Darn it. I was hoping he was kind of weak and I could kill him. So, apparently some of the worlds will get really open later on, hopefully. I mean, some people say they're too big, but I don't see how a world can be too big. Like, I mean, I'm used to World of Warcraft, so, I mean, the world was completely open, so. Come closer, Acolyte. The wind outside has torn my ears to tatters, and my eyes grow strained and bloody in the dark. I've studied this tomb for years. Slept on its stones and dreamed of its depths. Now, I need assistance to solve its final mystery. I don't dig through dirt for scholars. <laughs> then you misunderstand the chance I am offering. This tomb is the final resting place of Tulak Horde. The tomb's maze was built to his Tulak precise Tulak what? Sounds like a... But he built this really, really sounds like a uh, Klingon or something. He built it to secure his greatest creation, his terrible machine, the Red Engine. Keep going. What Red Engine? The machine was his life's work. A perfect puzzle that hid all his secrets. It was a vault and a library all at once. The scholars in the Academy, they say the Red Engine was never completed. They say it never functioned. But I know how it works, and I know how to fuel it. What do you mean, fuel it? Listen now. Anyone can activate the Red Engine, but unless it receives its sacrifice, it will only sputter and die. The machine needs blood and hatred to become fully operational. If a Sith could slay the tomb's beast in its presence, their deaths would be its fuel. Find the machine within the tomb. Work its mechanisms. And when at last it reveals Tulak Horde's secrets, I beg of you, bring me its scripture. Bring me the knowledge I have dreamed of.
Cool story, bro. That's a heroic plus two, whatever that means. We're more interested in this one. So as much as we want to look at this one, let's disable this for now since we want to follow the class one. Who are you? Oh, Sentry. Blasted mining droids were tougher than I thought. I'm not going to make it, but I hope whoever is watching this will honor me. Escape slaves, store weapons. I'm sorry. Honor is not the Sith way. Asking for honor is not the Sith way, apparently. Hey, I got a buff from that other guy. Oh, that's cool. So, which way? Oh, this way. Wow. I could be wrong, but I think my uh, leap got upgraded. Oh no, that was his weapon. It's like, wow, that really got upgraded. Took a lot of damage there. I would normally spend a lot more time doing all the little side quests as well as farming a lot, but I'm trying to keep things a little interesting for you guys. What does that mean? I don't know why he has a slightly different, like a friend symbol on him, or I don't get it. Yeah, see, why, why is his different than his? Don't get it, guys. I don't get it. All I know is I need to. Get my ass handed here. It's probably not even the room, is it? that part of it? Oh yeah, I have to gather pieces, don't I? Uh, I was like, seemed really lame. I was expecting an epic fight, even though I'm getting my ass handed to me almost. Really? Oh, what? Really? So, uh, I don't even know if I'm going to be Sith anymore. I wanted it to be Sith, but uh, from the PvP side of things, apparently most people want to be Sith. Like, I mean most people, like, a incredibly a lot of them. Um, the only downside with that is like, oh, so what? Uh, I like to PvP, and I don't want to be in a queue all day long, you know, trying to look for groups, so... You know, there, there's a point to where, you know, PvP may just not be quite recommended, unfortunately, but uh, we'll have to look more into that. So I bought two heal things, which are expensive as hell, which makes sense. Most games are like that, but uh, 
just in case, right? So some of these playing fields, they get kind of open and that's kind of cool. So we gotta go all the way down there. I haven't looked at my helps thing, so uh, praising animal, animal, oh, here we go, this may be a good one to read. Hello. Oh, that's just difficulty? I wasn't wanting that one. Defected. Oh, that's defeated. Why did I say defected, by the way? That's fail. Chatting, attacking enemies, looting, praising en uh, enemies' difficulty, but they don't tell you the special things on it. So... Okay. And defeated and maps. Oh, there's more gifts. Oh, okay. Better gifts, greater rewards. Not the different command, different kinds of gifts. Should really pay attention to the reaction. Oh, okay. Player and grouping. Two groups. All you need to do is right-click another player. Opening your inventory. Um, equipping items. Aw. If you're wondering what I was looking for, I was wondering for things like talents, etc. But I assume that's level 10 plus. Running's a little slow, but apparently level 10 plus, I guess, again. Uh, there may be some kind of run speed buff or something like that, so that's good news. Anything for run speed. Holy crap. Oh, the one person looked like their health was zero, but I don't think it was. It's hard to tell, I guess. Good news and bad news. It's easy to go through the content when there's a lot of players. Bad news, you go through the content too fast and you don't have enough uh, level for some of it. <laughs> like I didn't even have to touch one mom on my way through here. Oh, maybe it means they're grouped? I don't know. Oh, crap. That's for a party, I think. A dungeon or an instance or something? I don't need that right now, though. We're following this path. Okay, so we're going this way now. Really? Ah, I can't even see with this on. Excuse me, I don't, I'm not here to fight you, weaklings. Holy crap. Let's make this into uh, an orgy of beating me down. I just want to go and kill this dude who keeps threatening me all the time. Ooh. Uh, why can't I use that? That's weird. Why can't I use that? I don't get it. Oh, I didn't have enough things, but now. Holy crap, they all ran. Oh. They all ran from down the hill, which I didn't expect, because 99% of MMOs they puss out. But they ran down the hill. They make it sound like some epic, you know, survival thing here. All these people coming to save you. And it's just this tiny little drone. So. Oh, I lost my buff. I lost my buffy. Oh, 
Oh, here's his symbol. This is like halfway to an elite, I guess. Vendors? Really? You're gonna tell me about vendors now? Seem really easy. A little too easy. Yeah, really easy. So that was easy. Though since the, since the academy keeps owning me, because everyone likes to try to beat me down there. Maybe harder than we expect. So, you will find out here. Do 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 do. They like walking in this game. Welcomes to Star Wars The Old Republic, where we reskinned World of Warcraft with a more sci-fi taste and introduced more painful walking paths. No, I'm just kidding, guys. This is more like Rift skinned. World of Warcraft's not that good. Can't give it that much of a compliment. Uh-oh, what's happening here? I see greenness. You did it, didn't you? You got the shards from the tomb, and you're on your way back to Lord Barris. <laughs> what are you, an admirer? Are you here to congratulate me? I'll take that as a yes. Really? Why can't I hit him? Really? You gotta be kidding me. It's lagged out, so I probably am already dead. If you want to see what lag looks like, everyone. Oh, man. Oh, well, maybe I got lucky and got out of there. I'm sorry. I made a mistake. I tried to get through the tomb, but there were just too many Shirak. I barely escaped. I figured better to ambush you and take your shards. But I see that's just as futile. <laughs> Vemran is already inside with Barris. All the other acolytes died. You were my only chance. Now, I'm doomed. I'll never become Sith. Unless I return with the shards, Barris will have me killed. <laughs> I'll save Barris the trouble of listening to your whimpering. Die! <laughs> that was brutally funny. Oh, who do we have here? The vermin guy. The prodigal supplicant returns. And with all the shards from the tomb of Tulak Horde. Superb. It seems your hopes have been dashed, Venom. 
Appearances can be deceptive. Excuse Venran, supplicant. He didn't take kindly to you turning those young acolytes on him, even though they were only untrained novices. He should thank me. Novices or not, I bet he had his hands full. The tension is thick between you two. A great source of emotion to feed on. I wonder what will happen when it boils over. <laughs> you both stand on the precipice of becoming Sith. But only one of you will have the opportunity to claim a special lightsaber and serve as my apprentice. I thought it would be you, Venran. But I've changed my mind. What? I've done everything you've <laughs> asked. Better than any of the others. The honor should be mine. Ignore Vemrin, Lord Barris. His world is crumbling around him. Today, Vemrin is every bit your equal. But the Force is stronger with you, Acolyte. And there is a power sleeping within you. It was a simple decision. Now, oh. Vimran, go wait in my antechamber for your instructions. This instant. <laughs> now, I hope you fathom how fortunate you are to be singled out. If you become my apprentice, the galaxy will bend before you. I can't wait to start killing. <laughs> the lightsaber you will seek is old and powerful. It is housed in a forbidden cavern in the tomb of Nagasado, where Nagasagagohaga. Almost no one knows how to find the secret entrance, but there is a Twi'lek in the holding pens who was caught breaking in there. I hear she is quite willful. Take her and make her show you the entrance to the forbidden cave. That sounds like fun. I will enjoy bending her to my will. <laughs> yes, dominate her as you see fit. Oh, is that what it looks Other like? Other acolytes seeking to complete their trials are sent to the tomb, where academy laws are waived. They will try to murder you. This test will determine if you become Sith. So bolster yourself. To set foot in the tomb of Naga Sadao is to breathe in death itself. <sighs> Yes, I just did a breathe in. Yo, yeah. Apparently, I finally got a level up notice. This is what happens when it levels up. So this is the uh, saber. It doesn't look that, or it doesn't seem that badass, but whatever. Can I not click it, or maybe I, it's on in the belt? I can't tell. But anyways, um, yeah. So I think this episode definitely got it's full. It's full. Yeah, it's full. And I'm going to actually go back and do some side quests and level up a bit, collect some cash. And then I think I'll start uh, fresh on the next episode, just right out in front of the tomb. And make that episode kicking ass and getting that ancient lightsaber into my hand. Hopefully uh, that would cover it in that episode. So thank you for watching, guys, and have yourselves a wonderful day.